graduation time and Dr. Chad Wilson is super excited because the future of the workforce is graduating with skills that will have them ahead of the game thanks to EVIT. And I'll tell you, East Valley Institute of Technology doctor is awesome. I've been out there a couple of campuses and I'm so excited about this, and you are too. And let's just go ahead and tell them the good news that's going to happen, and then we'll talk about graduation. So, well, there, thank you very much for allowing us to be here again. And we're super excited about the opportunities that we have currently and the completion ceremonies that we're prepared to do next week. Um, but we're also really excited about the future opportunities. Eva, it's very fortunate to be in a position as our other CTEDs, thankful to the legislature and to Governor Ducey uh, for allowing us in the future to offer an associate degree. And so yeah. we look at it as an opportunity that bring individuals in, give them the ability to grow, in a program that they have a passion for, get an industry certification, start in the workforce, but stick with us and get that additional education that kind of lets them lean into future opportunities within the, the industry they've selected. So we're very excited. Yeah, and this was something that you were hoping for was going to happen because you saw the need there for these students to, to leave with a degree because it's almost like it discouraged them going, well, what am I doing these mm -hmm. years for if there's nothing for it, mm -hmm. for, you know, nothing for me, mm -hmm. but now there is. And we were just talking before we came on that I know an 18-year-old kid who's now like in charge of a garage, thanks to you guys. Um, we were talking about that they have a jump on the workforce mm -hmm. because it's needed right now. And you mentioned about, uh, of course, the foremen, the superintendents mm -hmm. who are starting to age out, and that's where these, can, these yeah. skills can help. Yeah, so you know, what, part of what we know in the, in the state of Arizona, because of our robust economy, that we're gonna be in a position of always needing to increase our workforce. And so EBIT has a unique opportunity to bring individuals in, both high school and adult, and give them the skills and the tools and the industry certification to enter the workforce. But with the associate degree, what we also have the ability to do is to give those individuals the opportunity to grow within their profession. And we talk to our business partners all the time, and they, they have a huge need for entry-level workers, but they also have a growing need for individuals within management within their organization because those those positions are aging out as well. So our belief is, is that a student, a high school or adult can come to us, earn an industry certification, have a passion for a career, stick with us, earn an associate degree, and now leverage themselves to grow in that field, not only as an entry-level worker, but also into management. And we think it's a it's a, it's a win for the student and it's a win for our, our business and industry partners. Yeah. Um, we're also talking about our workforce. Mm -hmm. um, just across country we hear unemployment's down yes it's down because no one's applying for it because they can't right now mm -hmm. and we might as well be honest that you know what we've run out of it a little bit and people aren't going back to work like they should but these programs here are helping those get those jobs that are out there right now that, that we need to fill. Absolutely, I, you know, it's really, it was an interesting experience for us because during the pandemic, we, we stayed open. Um, it's hard to teach a student how to weld virtually. And so we stayed open hands on instruction. And what we found was out of our 40 plus programs, like 37 of them were defined as essential services. And what that tells us is the work that we're doing, the, the learning our students are, are achieving is exactly what keeps America strong. And so I can't tell you, we get contacted by business and industry daily looking for our students, looking for our graduates, because there is a need in the workforce. Uh, industrial trades, construction, we know that we have a booming uh, economy here that's going to continue for the next foreseeable future, and we've got to be proactive in replacing those positions. And at EBIT or other CTEDs, that's what we do. We give individuals the opportunity to come in, um, get a career pathway, get industry certification, stick with us, get an associate degree, and have a career that you can make real money. Yeah. Real money. It is real money, and I hope I'm not going to get in trouble for this, but I'm going to say um, you know, doctors are great, nurses are important, we're celebrating Nurses Week, but we really need welders, we need these construction people. So mom and dad out there thinking that, you know, you're gonna be a construction person, well, why not be a lawyer, doctor? Well, mom and dad, they're gonna make more money, mm -hmm. faster, retire much earlier, mm -hmm. um, and they're needed right now. And I know right now we have a building going across the street, and I, someone even asked me, hey, you know any people who weld? Yeah. I mean, so people are welding, and then they go to the military with mm -hmm. welding what they need, too. Mm -hmm. So yeah, this it, is great program. It is. You know, I tell parents all the time that, um, you know, doctors are great, lawyers are great, we need them. Um, but we have positions open in our state in which individuals at the age of 18, 19, 20 years old can make fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 a year without having the college debt and do that over the course of their lifetime and have the compensation increase. So when you, when you kind of exit out the lifetime earnings, in many cases, the programs that we have on our campus, 
campus outpace other traditional professions when you take out the college debt, you take out the time in which you're in college and not in the workforce. And so I tell parents, you know, listen, the, if we, the, our state desperately needs the, uh, the workforce that we're developing, and you can make real money. I like it. I like it. Um, okay, so I know we're going to summertime, but is Yvette still open during the summer, or is it all year round or just during the school year? So because we have both high school and adult, our high school session ends upon completion, which is next week, um, but we still offer several adult education sections. And as, as our organization continues to grow, part of the commitment we're making is to continue to utilize those spaces year round. Uh, we're so grateful for the taxpayers. They've given us beautiful facilities, and we should be using those 12 months out of the year, not nine months out of the year. We should be using those 18 hours of the day, not nine hours of the day. So as we grow, we expand. We expect to expand the usage of those facilities into the summer as well. That's right. Dr. Wilson, I'm so glad you came in. Tell them Thank very you. quickly where they can find out more about Yvette. Um, www.yvette.com. Um, and if anybody has any questions, they can email me at cwilson at yvette.com. Be happy to help them. We encourage you to come out to our completion ceremonies. You get to see 2,000 students that are, are entering our workforce with industry certifications from all over the valley, Sloan Park. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, we're going to have over 8,000 people a night uh, participate. It's just really a fun event. There you go. And the kids will have their resumes ready to go. So if you're looking Please. for them, stop out there and hire right Please, on the spot. Please, absolutely. Listen. Please, doctor. <laughs> All right. The mix has still got a lot more ahead. So sit back, relax. Come on back.